One, two, three, four. Hey, hey guys, it is your boy Fruitless, and today I was playing Call of Duty, you know, uh, as usual, getting those double keys, because there's uh, apparently uh, going to be some DLCs dropping soon on Infinite Warfare, so I'm trying to get some supply drop keys, and I noticed that when I was playing Infinite Warfare Zombies, because if you guys didn't know, that's the best way to uh, grind out keys, this joystick is sticky, and if you guys don't know what I mean by a sticky uh, joystick, is when you're playing, you release your, you release your finger off this, and if you guys didn't know, I use Control Freaks. Um, basically, it just, it sticks. So if I do this and then a release, it doesn't look like it's sticked, but it's actually sticking. So if I release from there, it's going to keep going and it gets annoying. So basically, guys, all you want to need is some Q-tips or, er, sorry, and 50% rubbing alcohol. Um, you don't. I don't use hydrogen peroxide or water as I will screw up your controller. And if you guys didn't know, the I took my battery pack out just in case if anything gets on it. It you just want to let everything evaporate before you do anything. And I just noticed it says hello from Seattle right there. But um don't worry guys, we are not going to be voiding our warranty, which is right there. We are going to be cleaning it the right way. So basically, you want to get your Q-tip and you want to dampen it in rubbing alcohol. So I'll be right back when I've done that. Okay, guys. So I'm I just put my controller on the ground for right now, and I'm going to one second. I'm just gonna pour some into the lid so I can have a little. Okay, we got some rubbing alcohol in there, so we're going to put this in there, and you just want to let this lie above the cap for about five seconds. Let it moisten, and we'll be right back when it's dried. Okay, guys, so we're back. It's all... The most of it has worn off, but basically, how if you want to clean your controller, you want to pull your joystick back very far, and you just want to push in as far as you can with your Q-tip, with the rubbing alcohol, and just put that in there. You want to do this, and if you want, you can even clean all around here. Just do this, make it all wet, push in here three or four times, three, four, and then you want to switch it around, and you want to do it here. And then you want to do it up here. And if you want, guys, you could just clean this off. This joystick isn't that sticky, but I'm just going to do this and clean off all that dust there. And I know. Sorry about that quick cut. Um, My phone just ran out of space, so we're going to try and speed this up. So, as you guys can see, it has all dried up. And I've cleaned this set off. I've cleaned up here. So, if you have your q tips still. You want to dab, you just want to dab the top of your Q-tip, so it's about the top part right there, if I can get it to focus. You just want to dab that into uh, your little bit of um, rubbing alcohol, and you, again, you just want to put it right in there, and you just want to go around in a circle. You would roughly need around two um, Q-tips <clears throat> to completely do this. As you guys can tell, I have, I'm a gamer, I threw my controller and a chip there and that annoyed me. So now, this Q-tip is garbage, do not put this back into your controller, or you will put whatever, see all this black stuff on there guys? If you can focus, one second, let me try and get this to focus. If I can get it to focus. Right there, see all that black stuff? That was in my controller, that was on my joystick, and that was made it sticky. So, you want to throw this in the garbage just so you guys know I'll bend it and boom it's garbage you can't use it anymore so that's garbage now get another one and you just want to dab it no you don't want to dab you just want to kind of dab it around and you want to suck up all the ax excess um, rubbing alcohol to prevent um, any actual controller damage by the way guys I'm not responsible if you break your controller using the wrong uh, fluid as I said guys use 50% rubbing alcohol and if you do not have rubbing alcohol use vodka 40% that'll work just as well 
if you got, if your parents don't have vodka, then tell them that you need uh, tell them that they need to go out and drink. But once this is all dried up, guys, as you can see, it's all mostly dried. I'm just gonna keep dabbing it in there. Uh, I also did this side, but this side didn't have that much. You wanna then you wanna get this side. So basically, you'll be using four parts of the Q-tip in with two Q-tips, and you just want to make sure that you just push it. You don't wanna you wanna do what you did before. You don't wanna do this. You wanna do this. You wanna keep it straight up, and you just wanna rub it right around. And you want to make sure you've gotten all that. Now, if you look at it, you can still see some in there. That's fine. That's how you fix your controller, guys. I hope this helped you guys.